Hi, and welcome to Case Club. Today, we'll be reviewing our 22 to 36 graded comic book slab collector case. It's designed to hold 22 to 36 graded comic books and slabs, or up to 224 loose comic books. First, we'll go over the layout of the foam and then the features of the case. <laughs> When your case arrives, you'll notice a variety of foam plugs. These plugs are dual purpose, so do not discard them. For comic books and slabs separated by foam dividers, remove all the loose plugs and simply insert the slabs into the case. The case can hold 22 comic books and slabs separated by foam dividers. If you want to maximize capacity, you can trim off the foam tabs and store your slabs touching each other, which will increase the capacity up to 36 slabs. Cutting the foam dividers can be done easily with a knife or razor blade. If preferred, the case can be converted to hold 224 loose comic books instead of slabs. For non-slab comic books, we've included extra foam pieces that can convert the case design into a new configuration made for loose comic books. There are two parts to this conversion. First, insert the foam spacers into the sidewalls, which will make the pocket width tighter. For reference, the blank rectangular foams are inserted into the bottom edges, while the other two foams will perfectly nestle into the sidewalls containing the divider flaps. Finally, to complete the conversion, insert the last four foam pads into the bottom, which will ensure the comic books sit higher so the lid foam properly holds them in place. If you would like to further customize this case, you can even choose to hold a specific number of slabs and loose comic books at the same time. If you would like to hold a combination of the two, then simply cut the sidewall spacers to your desired length before installing them. You will notice for your convenience, we have segmented the bottom pad into four sections. Feel free to use just the sections you need or can cut these smaller as well for a more exact fit. Finally, one last note on the foam design. The bottom foam sections have finger holes which will make them easier to remove after usage. If you save them along with the other foam spacers, you can continue to change your collection over time while always retaining the ability to adjust the foam design accordingly. Be advised, this foam is an upgrade from Pluck Foam. Unlike Pluck Foam, this foam is pre-cut, ensuring a perfect fit for your gear and saving you time from having to do it yourself. Another advantage of our foam is its military spec characteristics when compared to cheaper foam. When it's closed cell, it won't absorb liquid and you can easily clean it if it gets dirty over time. Cheaper foam, on the other hand, will absorb any liquids and slowly deteriorate. Also, it provides adequate cushion for your gear, but won't tear like the cheaper foam. And the foam in the lid is a soft convoluted polyurethane whose ridges help secure everything in place when the case is closed. The case features four snap latches with positive feedback, two padlockable points for added security, in back two strong mechanical hinges, and feet so the case can stand upright on its own, a handle that folds down to stay out of the way when not in use, ridges that increase the case's durability when shipping. Around the perimeter of the lid is a gasket seal, which makes the case 100% waterproof. Please be advised, this case does not have wheels. Fully loaded with slabs separated, you can expect it to weigh 35 pounds. If you cut the foam separators off and fill it with slabs, the case will weigh 52 pounds. Therefore, you might consider our wheeled version with slightly less capacity if you need easy mobility. Otherwise, this case is best suited for long-term storage or shipping comics to trade shows. You can find this product and many more at caseclub.com, the industry-leading manufacturer of cases and custom foam. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.